How many times can I do this before it kills me? Hello everyone, Nameko, and welcome to kindergarten. Now, I know what you're thinking. This seems kind of weird. And trust me, it's weird, but like Champa and Z snorting a line of cocaine, kind of weird. Uh, trust me, you'll see what I mean. Okay, Kindergarten. I do know a little bit about the game. Specifically, we have an apple each, and certain actions require a certain number of these. We only have so many. Essentially, we have to beat the game while doing this. Here's one of our actions, which is to press down to take money, press up to put money back. So we have to choose whether or not we want to take money. Did we... Did we... Oh, okay, I see. Sure, let's take our entire piggy bank. Okay, and off to school, I guess. Erase or another day of kindergarten? Sure. Uh, what the hell? <laughs> I saw money. Yeah, someone's definitely got... Carry more than three dollars or what the hell are you part bloodhound? Uh, hey kid you carrying any cash? I mean Yes, but go screw yourself uh, Don't lie to me. I know when I can smell money. Give me half or else Um, Go dunk your head in that pond. Why don't you? Look kid. I don't have any time to argue this with you. Give me your money or your dead meats. I know a channel called Dead Meat. He seems like a really nice guy. I wouldn't mind to be him. Don't say I didn't warn you. Uh oh. Like I said, chimpanzee snorting cocaine. That's what this game is. Either bring less money to school or give half to bugs. Oh, car. But I'm stuck at this screen now, so I have to give him money or else. Fine, excellent, give me after I'll split your empty skull with my foot, you prudy wood. I mean, this dude doesn't seem that smart. We could give him, like, I don't know, like 25 cents and tell him it's half, right? I feel like you believe that. Now, don't go telling a teacher about this, or you might turn up missing like that Billy kid. Keep that in mind. And some of the text is yellow. I notice things that indicate what actions we could or couldn't take are yellow, which is interesting. Right. New hints unlock. Hint. That's how you use those. Uh, hints. It, ooh, we already started with several. Sampan, you know what the game is you play. You don't need any special items to complete gym own, Cindy, or teacher's missions. Okay, so I'm assuming special items, if I remember correctly, it's been a while, but special items are just well, special items, things you can get and use and bring with. But there are certain quests that essentially give you specific items that you can then use to influence other quests, do other things, and there is a shit ton of these. And it comes from the yellow text. You need to get rid of bugs in the schoolyard, start the day with more than three dollars. So I'm assuming that means, you know what? No, 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 We're just going to go through a normal day. <clears throat> Chimp chimpanzee snoring cocaine, not normal. We're going to go through one of these days and just get a feel for this game first, because honestly, I can barely remember half of everything I've seen over the years for this game. And the second one, there is two. There is two chimpanzees in this coke snorting thing hi my friends call me nuggets or they would if i had any nugget knows no love or friendship since billy went missing billy it's not yellow so love though that is what happened to billy i'm actually kind of curious billy is missing poor nugget misses billy but nugget cannot help him now it is too late do you know where he is nugget does not know nugget knows who knows who knows then uh, your question upsets poor Nugget, you push to our Nugget needs his pills. Much better, what were we talking about? Pills? 
Billy? Who? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, we were just talking? Oh, yeah, you were. Oh, we were not? You're... The principal has forbidden me from speaking about it. If you press me any further, I'll report you to him. I need to know. No, you don't. Enjoy your trip to the principal's office. Whatever. Um, what the hell are you? The principal just called me. He wants to see you enough. What did you and this little weirdo do? That's a good question. How does he know? Well, get the get going then. Principal is an impatient man, I'm sure. There weren't any cameras. I failed an assignment. Good for me. Uh, so I've been told you're feeling sad about Billy? Who told you that? Oh, you know, we're just, uh, gets around. You know, it, it doesn't matter how I know. It's that I do know. I'm not sad about Billy. Did I even know him? My apples changed. Did I even know the kid? Right? Am I wrong? Like, we're supposed to be new here or something like that, and we don't know anyone. So why would we even know who he is? Not sad. Oh, you're not? Then why are you so interested in dis disappearance? Were you listening to my conversation with Nugget? Yeah, were you? What? No, you shouldn't accuse authority figures of eavesdropping. I know what I know because I'm the principal, got it? I may look like I'm five, but I'm not a goddamn idiot. And are those Laura Croft's pistols? Laura Croft's? Yeah, I think I said that properly. Okay, sorry. It's becoming increasingly clear to me that Billy's disappearance has greatly affected you and to take these, they help Nugget immensely. You're giving me pills? Don't think of them as drugs. Think of them as portable therapy to help you cope with your feelings. So drugs. Okay, thanks. Take one right now. No. Take one or there will be consequences. Bite me. Uh, then you leave me no choice. I can't risk you getting closest. What does that mean? Is that a gun? When you have to ask if that's a gun, that probably means the wrong kind of situation is going on. Let's try that again and try and leave with a little less lead. No. No one told me that. Uh, not sad about Billy. Uh, so you're not interested in his parents? I'm not. I've been doing this all the time. I don't lie. When I see one, I know you're upset about this. The question is why? I don't recall you and Billy co being close before his disappearance. I don't, I don't even know who he is. I don't even know who the kid is. Um, he's not worth getting shot over. Who is Lily? What the f- Who is Lily? Billy and I were friends. I'm not upset. If you insist, I insist. God damn it. Can we leave this room? Uh, clearly a little upset about Billy's disappearance. This is the second time I've been shot. I'm just pissed about getting shot. <laughs> I'm not playing an FPS here. I guess I have. Sure. And that is all this is right about Billy missing. It's making you sad. You're not trying to find him or anything. Just say he's gone. Right. Phew. Okay. That makes this a whole lot easier. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to give you something. I want you to take it whenever you're feeling sad about Billy. What is it? Just a little sign or for this exact reason. Take one whenever you miss Billy too much. You gave me pills. Just don't tell me when you got them for me. The hall monitor is waiting to get back to class. Okay. Ooh. Considering he shot me twice, let's not mention the blood under the carpet or the nail or what looks to be, right? That looks like where someone has been dragged off under the carpet by shadow demons. And this kind of looks like because of the darker color, it kind of looks like something happened here and it's been bleached, which has drained some of the color. Considering he shot me twice before I was able to leave this room, it wouldn't surprise me. Oh, here we go. Welcome back. Uh, I hope everything turned out okay with the principal. Everything is fine for now. Say, the principal didn't have to give you anything, did he? For this first episode, I'm not going to give him voices because I'm a little tired. And also, we're, uh... No. We're working on stuff. What a shame. Okay, well, there's some still morning time left to go ahead and play. Fine, apples, okay. Uh, yeah, that's a knife. And that's 
something. What the fuck is that? Uh, should I meet everyone else? Do I want to risk using apples? What are you doing, Miss Jiggly? Uh, go find a morning buddy and you'll be- Or you'll be an outcast loser! Like, okay, what the fuck? Okay? Interesting! Well, you're not a very good teacher. Uh, who are you? Uh, what? You wanna be my morning buddy? I ain't got time for no nonsense unless you're buying or selling get lost. What the fuck? Are you the black market dealer? What the hell? Why is everyone in this school not what they seem? I mean, Nugget's about what he would seem to be. But the principal shot me twice, and this kid's selling shit. Uh, sure, so. What do you got? What about these? Oh, a whole bottle of those things? My guy who likes them is gonna be thrilled. We have four whole dollars for it. Sure. You went unlocked, okay? Uh, pleasure doing business with you. What do you have to sell? Yo-yo screwdriver. Cigarettes! Oh, I'm so buying the cigarettes. I uh, never took it for a bad apple that's only a couple left in the pack, so it's a discount. Deal. Okay, just don't show when it could get us both in trouble. Understood. What can I do for you? You can piss off. What if I give you these? Go find a morning by your being. Oh, okay, no. Can't do that. I guess we'll figure it out next time. Okay, kids, that's lunch, but let's go to the cafeteria for a nutritious meal. I hear we're having slop day. How exciting. Even prisoners don't get that. <sighs> I think I found where all the cocaine went. Jesus. Uh, you're, you think you're too cool. You'll curb stomp me again. Um... Got Cindy, we got Monty. I'm guessing you're selling more stuff. We got you, Lily, Nugget. Uh, we don't know everyone's saying, so that's good enough. Biscuits. Biscuits? Biscuits, right? Yeah, biscuits. Do you mean biscuits? Uh, biscuit. Bisc. Biscuit. Yeah, biscuit balls. Get your biscuit balls here. Gotta get them while they're hot. Biscuit balls? I mean, Resby came up with it after a little incident that happened recently. Is there children in them, and is its name Billy? Uh, what's in them? Uh, whatever is in a biscuit and a little something extra. It's the extra part that worries me. Oh, come on. Uh, try it. It won't kill you. No. Okay. Let's speak to a few people and see what the hell happens. I fear you'd be seeing me around now. Slop is so good, and I don't think anyone's brave enough to try a biscuit from the janitor. Demo- <laughs> I can't even spell it right! Is that so? I want to buy something. A uh, salad McGlob silly meal. Where- where are you keeping that? Uh, no, I'm good. Can we tell the old man that you said he doesn't know how to spell? Uh, biscuit balls, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Yes, we can. Oh, what? No, I didn't. How would you even know? I'm getting a read. Monty can, though. Uh, is that... <laughs> is that the dweeb with the glasses? Who am I kidding? Of course it is. <laughs> oh, I love you already. Hey, nerd. <laughs> Sounds like something I'd say. Uh, what do you want? Got some generous stuff you want to sell me? No, but I got a coffin for you to buy. Wait, what? Oh shit. Let this be a lesson to you about correcting people's spelling. That's one hell of a lesson. Okay. Okay. I'm guessing you'll use that mob to also mop up the blood. There. Lessons were learned. Lines were drawn. Holes were made through children's skulls. That is a sense I never thought I'd say. You are covered in blood. You're... What the hell? You're a good kid for letting me know that little monster's going around correcting spelling. And in a school of all places, shameful the way kids turn out these days. Oi! What are you saying? Uh, yeah. Shameful. Uh, but you seem to be one of the good ones. If it keeps that mop from being embedded in my school, 
Let's go with that. Uh, you just have to <laughs> janitor know if it, if anyone else has anything to say about spelling. I don't think that will ever happen again. Ooh, oh, these gusts brought the nerd's face when I hit him. You can have him. His old eyes don't miss a thing. Yeah, you have some great aim with that mop. Right. Okay. I can see something by an airbin and he's in his room. Okay. What about in the bathroom? Huh? You, you're you not supposed to be in here. I gotta take you to the principal. That is... Unless... Unless what? Well... I'm out of cigarettes. If you had some... Why would you assume the four-year-old had cigarettes? I mean, you're not wrong, but why? What the fuck is going on in this school? I do. Hell yeah. Thanks so much, little guy. Go on, do whatever you gotta do. Cool, thanks. See you around, little man. See ya. Mate, you're like only two years younger than me. What the fuck are you doing in a kindergarten? You keep smoking. Door won't budge, so someone must be in there. I'll try and stall. Uh, I can hear someone grunting on the other side of the room. Must be news. Good for you. I do not want to know what kinky shit's going on in there. Oh. I was about to say, maybe I can see if he'll sell me a screwdriver for the vent, but, uh, yeah. That's, uh, that's pretty rough. Uh, well, what did you say to him? You just rest now. Uh-huh. Hey, Nugget. Uh, no one ever sits with poor Nugget. Nugget does not have any friends. Good for you. Get me the fuck out of here. Oh, my head's still in one piece. Okay, kiddos, that's resale bell. Go to recess. Interesting. What the hell happened over there? Hello, Miss Jiggly. Uh, go play with... Oh, you're seeing young and thin. Uh-huh. Why the hell is the principal statue... Okay. No, 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 no. I was about to say, why is the principal's statue possessed by a demon? But maybe my first question should be, why is there a principal's statue to begin with? I'm good. Uh, hello. Uh, behold the Nugget Cave. It is very deep and very dark. What secrets does it hold? Do you want to find out? Sure. Deep could that possibly be? That took a good five seconds to hit the bottom. Jumping into holes you can't see the bottom of is generally considered a bad idea. I didn't know I couldn't see the bottom. What the hell? Okay, uh, Jerome. Don't bother me, kid. I'm trying to figure this out. Figure what out? It's this riddle about these stupid duck things. Apparently, you shake them in the right order. It's something supposed to happen. What's the riddle? Go twice a duck that's furthest south, two, then two blue before red. After return to the first duck, then blue. Get it wrong and you're dead. That's ominous. A good way to die again. Sure, let's give this a try. Good luck so, uh, selling that thing and don't want to get involved now I think about it. Good for you. That's probably smart. How many times can I do this before it kills me? I need to stop asking questions let's start here one two then it was twice blue before red turns the first i can't believe i actually managed that hi uh, sewing the real scenes have caused a Monstermon card to appear. Out of thin air? And what's Monstermon? Sure, I'll take it. What the fuck is happening? What's up with the statue? I know he did it, I know why, but I... I don't know why, but I know he did. What? What's up with you? This is a statue of the principal with these uh, red... Uh, red Glinton's eyes. Creepy. No kidding. Same back. There's a Monstermon car laying on the ground back. Sure. What are Monstermon and why are they just lying around? Hello. Go lay in the same races with my boyfriend. Who? No one's standing near you. 
I am officially done with this school. Hope everyone had a good recess, and let's all get ready for show and tell. What are you- Uh, why don't you go first? Who, me? Oh shit, I wish I had the cigarettes still. Okay. Uh, months went got- Oh, come on, you gotta be more creative than that. Bitch, it's all I have! <laughs> We're gonna skip you, who's next? Ouch. Well, Trun, that was fun, we'll show and tell. Alright, okay, that's about it, let's hope you all have a fun day. Well, first day of kindergarten, I died five times, right? <laughs> That's not normal. Okay, monster on cards, interesting. See, this is the literally grass card. It's literally grass, that's all. Okay, what about this puppy? Uh, this is the cyclone duckling card. It's not a species or anything. It's just a duckling that had its left eye pecked out by a bigger duckling. Okay. Special items, I see. And what the hell is this? Okay. I'm going to end this episode of Kindergarten off here. Very interesting. Very concerning. Um, I, you know, it, it's it's been a very, very, very long time since I was in Kindergarten. But from what I remember... Children don't usually end up exploding or having mobs impaled through their heads in kindergarten. But I may be wrong. I may be wrong. I'm not sure. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna end this off here. Yeah, chimpanzee snorting cocaine. Exactly the right description for this. This. For right now, I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Kindergarten. If you did, think about leaving a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Or in that, be good, be well, and I will see you, in, see you in the next episode. This is so strange, and I don't even know where to begin. Goodbye.